So Carlos, what happens if your inverter isn't on the supported list, your solar inverter or your battery inverter uh, for Amber Electric? What happens then? Will it never be on the list or are you working on, on making them? Yeah, good question. So we probably cover about 60 or 70% of the market at the moment in terms of what we integrate with right now. Um, we're working on uh, a, a good handful of Please contribute. It really helps my independent, honest journalism. Um, additional integrations, and that will continue. Will continue on. So, at the moment, we integrate with, obviously, with Solar Edge, with uh, Sig Energy, with Tesla Powerwall Two, Powerwall Three, as we mentioned before, uh, Redback, Fronius BYD, SunGrow. Um, uh, what else have I? Alpha ESS. Oh, that's right, Alpha ESS, and kind of some of the vari the variants of those, like. Um, yeah, NeoVault and Hive. Um, and then I guess we're, we're about to launch uh, Enphase for Enphase Solar and Enphase Batteries. We're about to launch uh, Give Energy, which is a big, uh, very big in the UK. Um, and then we're working on in the, in the background at the moment, um, Fox ESS, uh, SMA, SAJ, Goodwe, um, and yeah, a bunch of, bunch of other ones that will come through kind of over the next kind of six to, six to 12 months. Okay. In, I heard you're working on Anchor Solix as well. We are indeed, yeah. yeah. Cool. Anchor, Anchor Solix. Is there well. EcoFlow one yet, or they have not entered the Australian market? I know they're in America. No, I don't think we're. No. I mean, there's there's a, there are an awful lot of batteries out there. Um, yeah. We look at it in terms of kind of who's who's doing the numbers in Australia, um, and um, yeah, kind of try and follow the follow the market trends. Okay. To, uh, to so. What if you've got an older one that's not on the list and it's never going to be on the list? Should you still join Amber? Uh, good question. Uh, I would suggest if we can't control, if we can't control the PV and we can't control the battery, you're probably not going to have a great time with us. I'd probably suggest, yeah, looking at other retailers. Um, yeah, it's pretty important. Customers are going to have a, a much better time with Amber, particularly with Amber for batteries. If they, if we can control the battery, if we can control the the PV inverter. So with Tesla. Powerwall 2, absolutely fine. We can control that. That's an AC couple setup. With Powerwall 3, uh, obviously, it's a new-ish product uh, in the market, getting a lot of, getting a lot of traction, obviously. Um, we, can, we can control the battery. So when it's AC coupled with an existing PB setup, no worries at all. Um, if it's DC coupled, so as in if it's got panels attached to it, we can, we can control the battery for charge discharge, but we can't at the moment do curtailment. So we can't do kind of export limiting on, on the Powerwall 3. It's coming, uh, we don't have a fixed date exactly yet, um, but uh, hopefully hopefully soon. Um, and I guess the other thing for customers in Victoria, there is a thing called Backstop, um, which um, certain uh, distributors have approved and, and Tesla have got approval to uh, be able to control and export to the grid, but they're still, at this point in time, um, there's still, uh, Customers in Osnet and in Gemini region or network um, can't actually get approval for uh, to switch on their power walls and have them exporting to the grid. So um, just uh, I guess a, a couple of couple of little uh, flags to yeah. note there. Yeah, a couple of details to note, and all of that is as of mid August 2025. It could change tomorrow. It could change in a month. In three months, it's complicated because it's dealing with grid operators. And Tesla and Amber are all talking with each other and making everything work together. And they want to make it work properly first time around, not just sort of work. So they're waiting to get it done first time properly. Thanks for liking, subscribing and sharing my videos. It really helps me make more videos like this for you. And have a look at the suggested videos up above. I'm pretty sure you'll like those as well. Thanks and see you later.